It looks though like our Pictus gecko has laid eggs. We're not sure yet. We'll have to check. Hi! 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 Welcome to our channel. Hello. Hello. If you enjoy learning about reptiles and having a good laugh, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button. Hit. Smash it. Smash, Smash it. Smash it right now. And don't forget to hit that notification bell. Mass. Smash it. Mass. Okay. Mass. Maybe we have baby eggs. I heard these eggs are very fragile too. So they can break. So we're going to have to. Uh... <gasps> oh my goodness. Looks like we have eggs. Are we excited? Do, do, do. Okay, so really I was not expecting to have these eggs so soon, so I don't even have my incubator really set up, so here's a nice chance for us to do a set up the incubator and set up the eggs and everything. I'm going to get my handy dandy scale. Uh, the water please. This is the water, okay, I'm going to need that. I'm going to need some of this. and. This stuff always makes a bloody mess. Need the container, Avery? The little container, please? This one, yeah? Okay. So, so first I'm going to poke a few holes. One in the middle. Two. Three. Four. Five. Those are barely even holes. You don't even really need holes, but I'm just going to do it just in case. Because, I don't know, these guys are a little and fragile and I don't feel like really going in there too much. So, let's just... There we go. Okay, so we're going to measure the vermiculite to water. So, we're going to put this in. Thank you, Avery. Avery's shaking it for me. Okay, let's just say we got 14 grams, 14, 15 grams, very nice. I help you. You help me? Yeah. Okay, thank you. Thank you. The water, please. Water. It's usually one to one. So we're aiming for 14 grams here. Oh, there we go. 15 grams. A little bit more than one to one. We're going to mix this up. You're going to give me some paper? Yeah. Avery? Thank you for helping me. Just wait a sec, okay? Just wait a sec. I'm mixing it all up nice and carefully. No, 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 no. Now you want to help, so we want to make sure that everything's right, right? And we want little baby geckos, right? Do you want little baby geckos? So you want this to be really nice and evenly mixed. You don't want any of it to be too wet. You don't want it to be too dry. We've done that. I'm going to just let this kind of like air out a bit while I'm doing the other stuff anyways. And uh, now we're going to look at... Hey! Stop that. She's going nuts on the buttons. She sees buttons and it's just like, let's just touch them all. That sounds like a wonderful idea, doesn't it? No way, Reese. So now we got to prepare things. Everything's kind of everywhere. Can I have the big green bin, please? Careful, careful, careful. Two hands. Two hands. You put this down. Two hands. Very nice. Thank you. We bring it over here. So. I've modified this uh, Reptivator to make it better so that all the holes have, are, are filled with glue. And now basically we're going to dump some water in it. Okay. Uh oh, we need more water. Yes, you're helping. Okay, perfect. So, now I'll test the ridges a little bit. I'm going to put the uh, foam 
and perfect. I have my temperature probe. I'm going to stick the temperature probe basically right inside the middle of the tray. I'll do that as I'm closing it. So now we're going to move these eggs and try and be nice and gentle. You want to see the eggs move? Come, come over here. Very, very gentle. Very, very. We're going to look. One very, very tiny egg. Very careful. Don't, don't mess with that. Okay. Tiny egg. I'm just trying to be as gentle as possible. I heard these are very fragile. That is the tiniest egg. Look at how little that egg is. That's pretty amazing. <laughs> it's like half the size of a leopard gecko egg. There. So we're going to put that there. I want and then we're going to look for the other one. One egg piece. One egg of cat. I'm so terrified of like breaking these eggs because I've heard so many people have. The big eggs. We don't want to break the eggs, no. Mm. No. Nice? Yeah, we want to be very nice because we want more babies, right? More babies. Do you want more babies? My heart. Okay, I found the second egg. Oh, do, 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 do. My heart. Yes. I'm just trying to blow the dirt off. Maybe. You want to hold it? Yeah. Okay, look, it's so fragile. You cannot break. You stay very still. You're going to show everyone, but you're going to stay very still. Okay? Uh -huh. Is that cool? Isn't that so little? Cute. Is it so little and cute? Dinosaur. Yeah, very good. Okay. Dinosaur. Dinosaur. Yeah. Okay. Avery says all the eggs are like dinosaurs. Dinosaur eggs. Okay. So I'm putting the uh, the temperature probe right in the middle, and then I'm gonna close this thing, and they'll incubate for anywhere from like. 50 to 60 days because I find that the temperature usually inside the um, where the eggs are is usually about a degree hotter than the temperature is inside the incubator. Aiming for about 83 degrees Fahrenheit or 28 degrees Celsius. So we can see that I'll be able to see the temperature on the outside of the incubator. When I did my little um, incubation modification, I left one of the things open, and that's so that I could be able to easily run these cords outside from my incubation bins. So I have two displays just to keep me safe. I can see right here the temperature, and I can see right here. So. Now we're going to just let that be, mark down in our calendar, and uh, basically open up and take a look about once a week, make sure everything's okay. Avery, huh? are those the smallest eggs you've ever seen? Yeah. Wasn't that awesome? Yeah. Who had babies? Babies. Who? Baby eggs. Yeah. From where? I... From the little crazy gecko. <laughs> we call them the little crazy geckos because they're so energetic. Anyway, she's having a nice little meal. Meal? Yeah, she's catching some nice little bugs. Chubbing up. Yeah, that's Mama. So excited to have some baby Pictus geckos. This is the Mama. I just gave her a nice little meal so that she can uh, feel good after laying those eggs. And here's our proud little daddy. He is a little skinny. He mostly would only eat from my hand 
but uh, now he's starting to eat on his own, so hopefully he's going to put on some weight. So we're going to have some wonderful baby Pictus geckos very soon. They are like tiny, cute little dinosaurs. Yeah, look at that. Sun's starting to go down. There we go. I'm shaking. Okay. I'm telling you, these guys' colors change, like, pretty fast. Like, just a while ago, like, literally, like, a minute ago, I was holding him, and he looked way darker. And now he's just brightened right up. <laughs> oh, is that your tongue? Want to see more tongue? Show me your tongue. <laughs> Very cute. Yeah, that was wonderful, wasn't it? Now make sure you click. Take circle. Yeah, click the circle. Yeah, I did. And then watch this video or this one. No. Yeah? No. Yes. It's not that hard. Which one appeals to you more? Is it this one? Or is it this one?